uh, Brett Alton here with KnuckleJunkies.com here with uh, Marcus Brimage. Uh, <laughs> Marcus, what brings you to St. Louis? Oh, man. Um, first of all, my, my brother is uh, stationed here, so I want to give a shout-out to Captain Michael Brimage, you know, big shout-out to him. And uh, also here to support my man, T, uh, T. Woody, man. He uh, called my brother up and asked, can I come? I was like, yeah, man. I saw two birds, one stone. Visit my brother, his newborn baby, and coming here, the grand opening, ATT. Evolution. <laughs> That's how we roll, baby. <laughs> now, uh, you know, I'll say Ultimate Fighter uh, mm -hmm. contestant. Just kind of talk about that experience and how, how's, you know, how's your life changed since then? Oh, man, that was a crazy experience. Uh, actually, I'm happy for it, but it was actually worse than boot camp. Like, at least boot camp, we had some source of... Uh, outside, outside uh, information, like from your parents and stuff. When you about to cry, you write a uh, letter home to mama. She give you those encouraging words. You don't get none of that on the Ultimate Fighter. So you just got to man up and take it. But I actually am grateful for the experience because, you know, now I'm, I'm, I'm in the UFC, you know. Uh, I get to meet interesting people. I, I get to train, make different contacts from other fighters around the U.S. It's a great and beautiful thing, man. I'm very happy and blessed. Now, uh, you're, you're a member of Team Bisbing, and, ju and just kind of what was it like being around uh, uh, Michael and having him as a coach? Uh, actually, uh, Bisbing is a very likable guy. Yes, I said Bisbing is a likable guy. You know, everybody, everyone hates him so bad, but he's actually a good coach. He's actually, you know, fun to be around. Him, Razor Rod, McCollum, Tiki. I mean, those guys were crazy, man. So, I, I like Bisping, and I'm very happy that uh, he won and he beat uh, Jason Mayhem Miller, though. Uh, so, so what's next for you? I mean, what, what's coming up on your schedule? Uh, right now, I'm going back to uh, Alabama, roll tide, you know. And <laughs> going back to Alabama, I'm going to enjoy uh, Christmas uh, with my parents because uh, I didn't get a chance to see them for Thanksgiving. So, um, And I'm still on this 30-day medical waiver that they can make you do, you know, which is pretty mandatory. So just heal up, enjoy Christmas, and then uh, start back training the beginning of the year. And, um, you know, hopefully you'll see your boy somewhere around the March, you know, March spring at time uh, just any shout outs any plugs you'd like to give anybody uh yeah so i'd like to give a shout out to uh, american top team my new mma home uh shout out to uh, alabama roll tide we're gonna take that number one spot lsu y'all better watch out um the my guard unit the 117th every feeling wing down there in birmingham alabama thank y'all so much for y'all support and let me chase my dream uh my brother and his family uh t woody att evolution i mean that's about all I could give right now. You on Twitter? I am on. Oh, I am on Twitter. Uh, you can follow your boy at Brim B R I M two zero five, and uh, just see all the crazy stuff I'm up to. Also, if uh, you you ready to get sniped on some Halo Reach, man, holla at your boy Xbox Live Brim two zero five. Also, baby, I'm serious on Halo, baby. Y'all don't want none. What's up? This is the Bama Beast, Marcus the Bruiser of Brimage. And for your St. Louis MMA fits, go to knucklejunkies.com. Holla!